The issue often comes up, what is the speed at which you should respond to an important email? Should you get to it right away and send off your response? Should you wait? Should you ruminate? Should you write it up and revisit it later? I opt for the third possibility, which is write it up. In other words, capture your feelings right in the moment. Capture the essence of what you want to say when you first saw it and what your response is to it. But then give yourself 5, 10, 15, even 20 or 30 minutes, longer if you can. But during that time, an incubation effect takes place, if you will. You think about other things. You turn to other things. When you come back to the email, you have much greater perspective now. You're less likely to say something that could possibly be judged as inflammatory. You're less likely to retort in a manner that the other party might see as curt. You're more likely to be objective. You're more likely to be magnanimous. In other words, somewhat giving and caring and showing that you are concerned about the issue or whatever it is the other person posed to you. And so it's to your extreme advantage to have some separation between the time you first put your words down on the screen, saved it as a draft, and then actually fired off the email. We've all sent emails too quickly and we wish we could take them back and bingo, they've already gone out to cyberspace. Knowing that you're at your best when there's a little time in between your first thoughts and what you actually send may be the prompt you need to start that habit right now.